when I was a child, um, the friends that I had all liked to play with these fancy new toys that their parents got them and all these fancy new clothes, which I was privileged to have too, but um, I never really got much enjoyment from those, uh, that, those sources of entertainment and I never really was in with the style, it just wasn't really my thing. Um, what I really enjoyed as a child was uh, nature and specifically pine cones. Um, I don't know, there's, there's something about them that has this magical charm for me that, I don't know, something between me and pine cones just clicked. But um, they've really been a big part of my life up to this point. Whenever we'd get to uh, nature and science, I'd always be the best because I knew everything about pine cones and trees that produce pine cones. Everything about it I just love so much. So, so what are your thoughts on pine cones? Well, um, I, I've really gotten a lot of enjoyment out of pine cones. Um, they're really fascinating to me, everything about them. Um, even the fact that pine cones um, exist is a wonder to me. Um, just the shape, the fact that they're, they produce seeds for other trees in that form, that beautiful structure that nature's created. Um, it's really just amazing, and uh, I'd just like to thank God for the, the pine cones um, that he's created on this beautiful planet. So, so do you consider collecting pine cones a hobby? Um, at this point I really don't consider collecting pine cones a hobby, it's more of a profession for me now. Um, it's just a massive part of every day of my life and I wouldn't want anything differently. Okay, so over here there's a variety of pine cones. There's multiple trees over here that put out different kinds of pine cones. As you can see, there's a kind of pine cone like this. Uh, it's a little thinner. It's a lot. Uh, it's a lot smoother on the outside, but it's still a little rough. It bends a lot easier. It's not nearly as hard, um, and it's easily a different kind of seed than say a pine cone like this, um, where there's little spikes on the top. It's a lot harder. It's a lot rounder. So environmentalists would want you to enter the field of biology. What What are your thoughts on that? Well, um, biology has always been a really um, really predominant aspect of my life because that's um, because pine cones and pine trees and they're all in that category but um, and environmentalists wanting me to uh, help out with their cause for um, having trees kept alive um, I love that idea but um, I don't really want to think of my what I do now um, as a job because it would take away some of the creative aspect and put more of a critical aspect on it and I feel like that really wouldn't help where I am today to get to more of where I want to be. Does your passion of collecting pine cones get in the way of relationships? Um, well, I would say more um, at this point if I was in a relationship it might get in the way of me um, doing my studies with pine cones because that's my number one priority at this point in my life. Um, I wouldn't really want that to change and um, although I don't have that many relationships because I don't have that steady of an income, uh, I can't really get many jobs um, finding pine cones and uh, studying them. Um, I could get a job in biology but like I said um, the uh, work aspect of it really I don't think would add to my uh, creativity and my thinking of pine cones.